before this, I was getting 25 frames to 30 frames per second. It was pretty awful. I'm going to make this as quick and easy as I can. If you're trying to get frame gen for a 30 series NVIDIA graphic card, you're going to want to go to this website, nexusmods.com. I'm going to link it in below. You're going to want to download the universal one here. Do manual download. It'll make your life a lot easier. You'll get a zip file. That zip file will be here. You're going to just extract that file. And you go into the DLL underscore DBG help. You're going to grab this folder our file and this file. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into you'll probably have to um paste this in yourself. I'll put it below. You'll just change the user. And in here you're going to actually have one file type. I've already done this before. What I did for safety, I went on my um desktop and I created a folder. I just moved the original .dll in here. And what you're going to want to do is once you remove that file, you want to put in the dbg help.dll and the uh, dlssg amd is better <laughs> into here. Um, and that's it. That's literally it. Uh, after that, you're done. GG. You now have frame gen on your computer. And when you launch Borderlands 4, just to show what GPU I am using. I'm using the 3080 Ti. I'm going to let up this load real quick. Now, once you're in the game, you can go into options. And here you will see, once you go to advanced, you go into here, and now you have frame gen. You can turn it on and off. I will show you just my settings. So if you want to mimic them, I put everything to low. Because for me, I don't really care. This game is beautiful, even on the lowest settings. But to give you an idea, let me do, I mean, I was getting 30 frames per second before. Again, because I am trying to record this as well, my frames are kind of not 120 like they were but if you're playing by yourself or playing with your friends you will see average 60 to 90 by myself i've been seeing 120 but even still with having it recording using up that resource as well for my nvidia graphic card i mean we're still getting 80 frames 70 frames it's not that bad granted again if i go into a fight it'll get lower because well obviously you know <laughs> It's going to take more of the GPU to record and all that fun stuff. So if you're trying to stream the game or anything like that, please be aware you are going to be maxing out your GPU. You're going to be doing it. It's going to happen. Just be aware of that. All right. That's how you get better frames.